Who thought of putting a bolt right there up under that whip? Two of them on this side. So this is a three piece valve cover. There's bolts down on the bottom. I was just gonna take, try to take both of those pieces off at one time, but unless I don't know something, these were nuts, but it only holds on the top one or the second one. You have to take the second one apart in order to unscrew those studs that have nuts on the bottom. That's the reason why I had to uh, pull the intake last time to get them ones on the other to get these nuts I didn't have a socket so I had to put a wrench on it because it's pretty long that's why I pulled the intake I remember now correction I don't have to pull the intake to get them bolts there's the nut right there and I can't get them off so what I'm gonna do I'm pulling the head with the turbo the manifold and the intake all off at one time i'll take it apart on my little metal table also the intake pipe and i'm going to leave it on the intake i'm going to pull this pipe and see if i can just leave that together maybe i won't have to mess with it be one less thing one more thing i still got to loosen those pipes but this is the part I hate the most, is unhooking all those wires. But we'll get it. Okay, I gotta get these injector lines off before I can proceed. Let's see if I can get them with a wrench. I, I, I welded one together, I can't find it. So, I ordered the tool to, I think, but I can get them loose. <clears throat> yeah, that will come loose. Let's see. Get it? Yeah. Got that one. They're a little tough. But I've had them off before, so... I had a, a wrench that I welded. I might have to come back to that one. Got that one. Let's see. You can get it on there, but you can't hardly turn it. There we go. Got you. Uh, I'm gonna have to work for that one. I got them in order just in case. Hmm. 
He's heavy though. last one with a wrench or a socket this is gonna make life a lot easier on that back one yeah I'm just going to leave the bolts in them. Inch and an eighth is what I used. An impact socket. Hold on. I may have to remove the bolts. Had to leave that back bolt in there. Okay, I'm gonna pull these uh, push rods out. I, they, I believe they are exactly the same. I'll pull those out and uh, save you the boredom of taking them lines loose and that other pipe. And um, I'm wondering if that hole looks a little rusty compared to the other ones. I wonder if that might be where my crack is. 
because the bolt looks a little rusty too and the rest of them are kind of oily and um, but it was coming from the back maybe it was running down I don't know we're gonna try to find out but the next video we'll get to pulling these head bolts out and uh, see if we can get it pulled off y'all have a good one
All right, we're gonna pull all them head bolts out. And there's a little bracket right here on the front. Four bolts. I gotta take that loose. And a couple little wires. And uh, it should be about ready to come off and that'll be the next video. So y'all stay tuned.